Okay, what I'm showing you here is the operating system Leopard. Uh, it's a Macintosh system. It's going to be, well, it is installed on my Dell Inspire on 9300, so I'm going to show you guys that here. I'm going to boot it up. So you got the Dell logo there. Um, now it's going to ask me what operating system. There you go. Leopard X. Enter. I mean, it boots fairly fast, and uh, this this computer is around four years old. Runs very low on, uh, you know, as far as uh, RAM used. Uh, pretty pretty fast for uh, for this uh, Leopard uh, program or for operating system. The, uh, the Windows really wasn't as wasn't as fast, honestly. Um, I don't have as much on the hard drive either, so we'll see in, in due time. Here's the uh, icons here at the bottom. The only thing that, that I wasn't real impressed with, um, and of course it's because this is an Intel board and this is a Mac operating system, is that I had to go ahead and put a program on here. It's a third party instead of the Mac Airport. It's this right here, the NSGUI for my wireless card. So I, know it was a little, I had a little problem getting that to work, as well as, you know, when I first installed, I, I didn't my keyboard or my mouse wasn't functional, so I had to use uh, USB ports. Uh, but as you see here, I'm going to connect to the Internet. Let's see. Open the main window. Let's see here. Find, uh, oh, okay. Find available networks. Okay, got my network there, connect to it. Okay, so now what I'm going to show you is how I can go ahead into Safari. Which I mean, the Max, it's, it's pretty cool to run. Um, of course, this is a cheaper way to run it than, than buying a, a MacBook. They're pretty, pretty expensive. I'm on Google.com here, let's see. It should be coming up soon. There you go, Google. And that's running wireless. Uh, runs runs pretty good. Um, of course, I don't have much in the cache, so um, pages take a little longer than at this time. Let me show you the dashboard. This is pretty cool. Just kind of like just like the iPhone, you know, as far as the weather goes, and got a calculator that comes up. I mean, it's just a little bit different just something new to try it here but it is possible like I said I'm running on a Dell I am running Leopard so um, just wanted to show you guys it's possible and if you have any questions hit me up